morning guys, Phil here from Phil's Craft Corner. Hope everyone's alright. Today I am super excited because I've got my new PC parts. They've just come, just got them out of the box. Um, well, to be fair, I'm a little bit worried because uh, this is how it came. I have undone this tape and had a quick look inside. Uh, what they've done is they've assembled the bits that I bought, which was a motherboard kit with some RAM. Uh, they put it all together, put it in the box for me. And shipped it that way. So, let's take my old bits out, put the new bits in, and we'll see if it's any better. Alright, guys, so this is my current PC. Uh, this is a case I've had for about nine years, nine and a half years now. It's a CM Storm case with uh, red LEDs in there, with side screen, it's full of dust because I don't really treat my PC as well as it could be treated. It's a tool to be used, and that's about it. Don't use it for gaming or anything like that. It's there for me to use with the laser machine to engrave onto there to make designs for my woodworking. And that's basically it. This is why I've had this one for 10 years and not really had to upgrade it. The only upgrades I need to do on it is I need a faster processor, I need some better RAM, and to get that I needed a new motherboard. So that's what I've done. I spent around £300 including delivery. Uh, it was from AWD-IT. They sent it out next day, which is quite surprising, even though it was two to three days on delivery with DPD. I got text this morning after ordering it yesterday and said it was going to be delivered today. And I've just got it, so now I'm excited. And I'm going to be nice. I'm going to get in here. We're going to take everything out. We're going to give it a nice clean and... I'm going to start looking after it now, spent some money on it. So, let's get started.
Okay, let's uh, go and put all the cables back in. We'll plug it in and we'll see if it works. It did not work. I spent the next three and a half hours staring at these screens, diagnosing, recompiling the bootloader until I finally got it working again. Once I did get it running, the first logical thing to do was to run a pass mark rating test. So these were the old results. As you can see, I was in the bottom 25% percentile, really low results. And this was with the new results, and I am in the top 64% now. And that's, that's a massive increase uh, for just £300 spent. Right guys, as you can see, I had a few issues with the build. It took me around three and a half hours to actually get it up and running again once I hit that power switch. It was nothing to do with the way I'd built it or anything to do with that. I didn't do any of that internal things wrong. It was just that hard drive, the bootloader got corrupt on that and it, it took me a while to get that sorted out. But once I did, it was up and running and it's absolutely amazing. Lightning fast compared to where it was, which was taking 45 minutes roughly to render a five minute video, which took all the joy out of video editing. It was a nightmare to use, and now it's an absolute dream to use. Everything's just so snappy, I can drag something over, it just clicks right into place, and when I render a video that's around five minutes, roughly the same, uh, I didn't want to do the exact same video because it might have cached in the background somewhere and that wouldn't have been a fair example. I did a brand new video, roughly the same time, I think it was around 45 seconds longer. Uh, roughly the same content, the same amount of editing. It took two minutes to render. Two minutes! 45 minutes to two minutes and it only cost me £300 to upgrade. So if you are looking to try and do a bit more with your PC, have a look at upgrading because to build a PC with the specs that I've got in there now, I'm looking between seven or eight hundred pound minimum to buy that PC. So I've saved myself half of the cost just by using the stuff that I already had in my old PC and it isn't too difficult. Everything can only fit one way, everything's labelled and if you're not sure then somebody on the internet or somebody in your family will know how to do it. Trying to talk to people on the camera and I have this big fat baby of a cat purring away and distracting me. Ow! He's not like being called a big fat baby, but you are. So if you liked this video, if you found any of it entertaining, if you found it informative, useful, if you're going to build your own PC to save some money, just hit that like button. If you fancy it, just hit subscribe, hit that bell notification, it makes me really happy. I can't believe I've got 71 subscribers so far, and I've only really been going a month and it just makes me so happy so if you do want to make somebody happy hit that subscribe button and thank you very much